Hi, in this video, I will show you how to do the numerical calculation for CFD, which is computational uh, fluid dynamics with Microsoft Excel and the simple uh, example. Uh, here you can see the Navier Stokes equation. And this, in the left hand side, there is a first order partial derivative of uh, velocity component with respect to the time. And in the right hand side, there is a second order partial derivative of uh, velocity with respect to the spatial coordinates. Let me simplify this equation by erasing all the terms except for the, mm, these two terms. This equation is adjusted and simplified equation of Navier-Stokes equation. A is a scalar of physical quantity and is function of x, y, and t. It looks like a function of uh, two-dimensional heat conductivity. Uh, to discretize the function, I changed the del symbol here into the delta symbol here. And when I write all the details, the function changes into this function. Let me explain this by showing the grid system. Uh, this is the grid system of the function uh, x, y, and t here. Uh, you can imagine the x-axis is like here and the y-axis is like here. And delta t, delta x, and delta y is like this. This is delta x and the same length, delta x and this is delta y and this is delta y and this one is y n plus one and y n y n minus one x n minus one and x n and x n plus one uh, and t n here uh, is time t in time step n so this grid system is showing the values when the time step is time n i time step is n and uh, when we express the fun express the delta x like this uh, you can show the the meaning exactly and our objective is to calculate the value of a of time time t m plus 1 from the values of a of time t n and each equation calculates a x n y n t n plus 1 from these five points of time step n now I explain the equation because the terms are quite complex let me change the terms for x here into square and the terms for y into circle and then the equation can be expressed like this uh, the function becomes uh, after if I transpose some terms uh, oh sorry uh, 
exp mm, if I transpose some terms here delta t and egg a in the time step n the equation ch changes like this now let's go to the example grid system the zeros in green square is the initial values of a uh, which means the time step is t zero and the numbers in the blue squares in the a, a, x and y coordinate system is the coordinate system is x x and this is y and the numbers in these uh, red circle are red squares and for the boundary condition only the terms of the right side is zero and the others are uh, one here what I wrote in the Excel sheet is like this uh, delta t delta t is written here and in the right right part I wrote the initial values uh, and the uh, boundary condition and the left part I the calculation is conducted yeah. the equation is put inside here as you can see here the right part stands for the values in time step n and the right left hand side stands for the values in time step n plus one uh, we, we use five values in time step n to calculate the values in time step n plus one the calculation of the x-axis li is like this this and this oh sorry for the y-axis like this and this and this one is a value from the center and delta t is multiplied here and the former terms sent for the for terms of x which is square and the latter terms sent for terms of uh, y which is circle here just like this and this is what the uh, example works in the Excel sheet in the left part I wrote all are the initial condition and the boundary condition in the oh I'm sorry it's, it's right hand side and in the right part the calculation is conducted now this is t0 and this is t1 and then I copied the value values from left part and paste it on the right right side and the when I paste it I just uh, paste it values and and then I copy the value from the left left part and paste on the right side again then the values are copied here it change it and I use the macro 
macro and conduct its iteration by using the, the macro then it change the values are changing like this Yes, uh, that's all. Thank you for watching.